Thanks, Craig. And my guest today is Rosa. And Rosa is one of Arlington's longtime business owners. She's been here for 25 years, and she has done it all. It's amazing. She's met Mother Teresa. She's had Gloria Stefan at her parties. Congressman Tom Davis, uh, Emerald's team came to her meat store. Unbelievable. Welcome, Rosa. Thank you. I want to talk about all this and more. Thank you. You are like the most energetic person, the most energetic businesswoman. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, the Holy Spirit. <laughs> yes, uh, exactly. Yeah. Why do you have a business here in Arlington? Well, we started um, oh, 22 years ago. And uh, my father was a businessman in Maryland, so my husband and I got all his So that's where you get it from. From here. My brother is a jeweler. He has Silver Spring jewelry. So we just, uh, my, my father said, oh, this, has this lady selling a business in Arlington. I said, my husband said, oh, let's go. So. So we bought it, and her husband was from um, from Peru, hmm. and they sold the business, so we bought it. And what do you so specialize in? Uh, we started fresh cut meats, you know, fresh South American cuts, Argentinian sausages, we make it fresh. I Italy. hear your sausages are really good. Yeah, it's not because it's ours, but it's it's very similar to Italian sausage. We put wine, mm -hmm. but we don't put the finocchio. You know, finocchio is, a, is Italian spice. Oh. It's like, a, like fennel, wow. but we don't put that. So it's more South American style. And if you, put, if you put it in the grill, it's one of the best. Wow. The, the taste. I yeah. remember I tried some a couple months ago, yeah. and it was really good. Yeah, we're very famous. People from the embassy come, from Argentina embassy, where they have all these events. And you have the wine at your store? I know, I have the Argentinian, the Argentinian wine, wine, your number one seller? From Mendoza. I do tasting every Friday, Saturday. And the dates, the, the wine. For free, anybody can come. Yeah, for free. free. And the number one is flavor is Merlot. They love American people, they love them a lot. Wow. And when they try with my sausage, the French bread, and the chimichurri sauce, you know, we make like a specially pesto sauce. They love that because it's fresh, you know, it's freshly made. Wow. Sound, sounds delicious. Yeah, fresh it's, it's it is fresh. delicious. Yeah, it's real good. We, make, I, we buy the parsley fresh, and my butcher make it. And you make yeah. it right behind the store yeah, here in Arlington, Yeah, in the butcher too. area. Yeah, it's, so a lot of people don't know we're here. And tell our viewers where you are. Yeah, we are 2719 Wilson Boulevard. And what's the name of your business? El I know it's on the El screen. Chaparral. It's El Chaparral. It means meat market. Oh. El Chaparral meat market. It's a, uh, it's El Chaparral means it's a South American word. It means like a small tree mm -hmm. from the La Patagonia. So we kept the same name because I like it. It's great. Yeah, and you've been nice. here for so long. I know the neighborhood's changed, but I what's know. changed about your store? Well, we're trying to uh, make it nice now. I want to make it more for the area because a lot of tourists, mm -hmm. a lot of Americans, a lot of nice people, young kids. And you have a gelato. You yeah, started so your idea. Yeah, my husband from Italy, and we go to Sicily uh, all the time. I went to Sicily. I want to go with you. I know. I went to a wedding a couple years ago. My goddaughter got married. So wow. gelato everywhere, every corner. I said, I told my husband, that's it. I'm making my gelato. So uh, And it's so good. Oh yeah, my I had God, my dream, my flavors. gelato, my cappuccino, you know. Wow. And I see we only have two minutes left. Yeah. So I'll ask you quickly about the future. Yes, we're trying to make it nicer. We're trying to fix it little by little. So mm -hmm. I'm from Cuba, and I want to make it more like a Cuban sandwich, make it like deli, Excellent. Italian sandwiches. You know, I want to not make it for one country. I want to international to please everybody. I want to keep my customers too, you know. And let's talk about in your international, some of your other mm -hmm. international work. You do nonprofit work. Yes. And you started, I heard, because of Mother Teresa. Mother Teresa. Is that right? You yes. saw her? I had her call. Oh. Yeah. I started four years ago. It's called Alianza Latina. Yeah, I saw her a long time ago before she died, uh, 12 years ago in Maryland, San oh. de Baptist. She shook my hand. I was on TV, a newspaper everywhere. I was in ecstasy, you know, she shook my hand. And she said, keep up your vocation. Wow. So I helped her orphanage in D.C. And you're still everywhere. Yeah. yeah I, give, I gave her meat for my market for homeless. They cook soup for the homeless. So I used to give bones and they make soup. And I helped the kids and the orphanage. And I you still help, help kids with I still orphanages help overseas. Yeah. That's no, they, they don't have, they used to have it here in Maryland. Mm -hmm. uh, but they, they lost a the license. Oh. They used to bring kids for, for adoption. Wow. And by now they have like a daycare mm -hmm. in Park Row. So my dream is to help them. Um, they can get a bigger house. Maybe they can get the license back because they need nice. a nurse. They have to have a nurse to, to have to have the license back. But sometime in the future. But right now they want they need a bigger house with a yard to hmm. put the kids daycare. Kids can play. Wow! So that I promise I'm gonna get it for you. <laughs> that is great. And you've yeah. had a number of uh, bands and people come. You had Gloria Stefan yeah, come. Yeah, her her band her band came. They play for her in South Beach. They came for my party, my first party. Unbelievable. And, uh, Right now, and then uh, we have another band from New York, Fajardo, Cuban band. 
they came two years ago, and we help uh, the kids in uh, Salvador and Peru. Great. Well, thank party. you. You do excellent okay. work. Your nonprofit you. work, your store, unbelievable. Thank you. And you have another project in Manassas, and you'll have to come back next time to I tell know. us yeah, about that. I have that. to tell you more about Manassas. Please. That's another project. That's another project. <laughs> and now, back to the desk. All right, thank you, Pia and Rosa from Chaparral, a little meat market right around the corner here from our studios on Wilson Boulevard for uh, telling us all about your place. They've been there, what, 20 years, something 20 like that? Years, longer yeah. than anybody around, probably, back when Sears was there, I guess. Hmm. How do you think about that? <laughs> I don't even know where it is. Yeah, okay, it's right out here in Wilson Boulevard. Anyway, that's yeah. it. Uh, thanks, Pia, and uh, thank you, crew. Thank you, talent, everybody who uh, helped put our show together. That's another edition of the Arlington Weekly News for this week. Thank you, Daniel. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you, Rich. Join us again next week for another edition of the Arlington Weekly News. Take care. We'll see you. Bye-bye.